Have you just got a BPA parking ticket? I got this one a while ago and I actually managed to avoid paying it and I want to help you with yours too. I've had an embarrassing amount of parking tickets and over the years I've discovered that there are different ways to appeal them. I'll take you through my six point checklist but first I want to let you know exactly what could happen if you avoid dealing with the BPA parking ticket. Worst case scenario, you've totally ignored the ticket and it hasn't gone away. I had the bailiffs at the door and I had to pay £700 to get my car unclamped, so I don't want you to end up in a mess like I did. But since then, I have armed myself with information and I know how to fight back. Which brings me to the six point checklist. Have you heard of a grace period? You've still got 10 minutes after your ticket's expired to get back to your car before BPA can issue you a ticket. If this is a case for you, then you have a legal right to appeal. You could go back to the scene of the crime and check that all the BPA parking signs are totally clear. Now don't be afraid of being a bit of a stickler and take photos of everything that could be just slightly unclear as it may help your appeal or if it comes to it, your defence in court. Remember that it's BPA's job to have clear signs about parking and CCTV and if anything isn't clear, then it's their fault, not yours. When did your ticket arrive? If you didn't get a ticket physically stuck to your car and it took longer than 14 days to arrive in the post, then you might be entitled to more time to gather information for your appeal. If you can prove that an emergency stopped you from getting to your car, maybe you ended up in hospital or something else equally as drastic, then you've got a good chance of BPA accepting your appeal. It's really unlucky if your car broke down in the car park. What a rough day, a breakdown and you get a ticket. I can't help with a breakdown, but it can be a legitimate reason to appeal a parking ticket. You can chat to your breakdown recovery provider to provide you with proof. If you're a worrier like me and you need a professional opinion, then you could speak to a solicitor. In-person solicitors are great if you like to chat face to face, but there are online solicitors that you can use like Just Answer. It's really easy, you just tell them what happened in the chat and they'll give you a professional opinion about appealing your BPA ticket. It's only a fiver for a trial to get all the answers you need and it could save you a lot of money. There's a link in the description if you want to check it out and support my channel.